I feel so bougie, bitch. I feel so, like, I look so fucking good right now. This is faux fur, by the way. As always, never real fur. Fuck that shit. Okay, so I have an exciting before I start the car. Sorry, it is a little loud. There's nothing I can do about it. Um, also, I know when I, like, drive, there's that screeching sound. A lot of you guys said that I need to check my steering oil or steering fluid or whatever. My steering fluid is completely fine. I... We don't know what it is, but my steering fluid is like full and everything. So if you hear that screech, it's not the steering fluid. I might say it a few more times in different videos in case like people didn't watch this vlog because, you know, you're going to probably be hearing it a little bit unless I edit it out, which let's be honest, like probably most of the time I'll be talking because I like forget. Thank you all for like suggesting that I should do that, but... That's all good. Um, I'm about to be late, so I'm going to start my car. Sorry if it's a little loud, but like I said, I can't do anything. I will say, <laughs> I'm like, bitch, hurry up. Get to the point. I know what I was going to say. Rewind the fuck back. I was going to say that some of my windows were open, and I already addressed that um, in a previous video. But, yeah. So I have really good news. You guys know I have to get on the highway first before I start talking because... I have to do so much getting out of this neighborhood. I have to make sure I don't hit someone. I don't want to clock a lawsuit up in this bitch. This person's like riding my ass behind me. Normally it's me riding my ass, but I'm trying to go slower over the speed bumps. Shit, never mind. Fuck, I'll go my normal speed. Jesus. Okay. I just like being dramatic for entertainment, by the way, in case you're new. Like, people meet me in real life and they're like, you don't really act negative and it's like dramatic in real life. You're kind of just like chill and shy and quiet and that's the truth. Now to the actual video. Sorry, I probably edited the part of me getting on. Um, okay, so now to get to the actual video title, I ended up telling my friend on Wednesday, I think it was, that I'm trans. And it was so hard. Like, I felt, <sighs> I feel like everyone in the world is better at coming out than I am because I just get very awkward. I make them feel like they did something, but like unintentionally, obviously, because I was just sitting there and I was like, I have something to tell you. After like sitting there, like not acting like myself for probably like 15 minutes, cause I didn't know how to like start a conversation. And so I was sitting there and then I just said out loud, like when the conversation had died down, I was like, I have something to tell you. And she was just like, what? She was like, oh God, what? And I was like, I, I literally was like so, I was like physically shaking a little bit I feel like I was like I don't know I'm scared to tell you like I am just scared like I don't want it to change anything and I was hoping that she had some kind of like hint to like be like oh like but no she was like you didn't murder someone did you I was like girl no um so I just like let it out I was like I'm transgender and she was so shocked like she had no idea like not even a little bit of an idea like no clue at all and that shocked me i was like are you sure she had no idea and then i told her like a little bit like i told her that i felt like we couldn't be like deep deep friends and unless she like knew because i couldn't really talk about my past that much so or like I couldn't ever talk about problems because you know and that's what friends are for so she and after I said that I started crying a little bit and she was just like oh my god like thank you so much for trusting me to like tell me this which was shocking because normally I feel like it goes different than that normally I feel like they say some I don't I can't even think of like other examples but normally I feel like I don't know so I felt like that was really nice 
I just kept telling her that I didn't want her to treat me different. I didn't want her to tr treat me like I'm like better or anything. Not even like, I just want to be treated the same because I was telling her, I just really liked how she just treated me like one of the girls. Like, I don't know, like it wasn't a thing. She just, it wasn't a thing and I loved that. So, um, and she was like, of course, like I'm, like I think of you the same way and everything and I was just telling her that I would just be devastated if like she didn't end up wanting to be friends with me anymore because I have a hard time making friends with people. It went really well. I was crying. We, she gave me a hug which I don't even normally like physical contact. Sorry this is shaking a little. I don't even normally like physical contact that much but I gave her a hug because I was crying. It went way better than I expected like I was just honestly so scared um, and we I told her like a, f a few things she didn't ask thank God any questions like oh so do you have this or that none of that um, which I thought was amazing because I feel like that's so awkward when that happens when they'll be like oh wait so do you have whatever like I, I'm just like girl So it went really well. I'm really happy with it. I, it definitely did bring us closer, which is what I wanted. And even after I texted her a little bit about it. And because we had to leave, we had to go to class. But it went really good. And I'm really glad because a lot of you, every, when I made the video about it, um, everyone gave, left their advice on what to do. And I, I feel like I did take some. And overall, like me coming out took like the process or whatever <laughs> I don't know it was around like 35 minutes so that's obviously like this video is how long like a few minutes that is not all that was said and done um, that's all I can just remember right now but yeah it went really really well and I did use some of your guys' advice to like help. The, the parking lot is like empty I wonder if any classes were canceled that I don't know about Street shop. Overall, it went really well. I'm so glad about it. Like, honestly, I could see us being really, really close friends. She didn't know about my YouTube or anything. I told her that we should, like, make a video if she wanted to. Like, talking about it and stuff. I don't know. Um, let me know if you guys would want to see that and I'll ask her. Or like what you'd want to see. So yeah, people are coming. I'm going to go. Thank you guys for watching. I love you and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.